Holography is a system of methods of recording and reproducing spatial structure of monochromatic or quasi-monochromatic optical fields. Thus, it is possible to see a partially common task of holography and photography, recording, storing and reproducing visual images of the objects. However, photography allows to record on only resemblances of flat projections of the object's surface illumination distribution, but holography gives the opportunity to reconstruct an exact spatial structure of the light field dissipated by the object. That means and it can create its optical copy, which is visually the same as its original. The idea to record and reproduce the structure of electromagnetic fields was initially expressed and demonstrated by Dennis Garber in 1948. He also introduced the term hologram, which is translated as a full record. Garber's works had not been developed much until lasers appeared as holography needed light sources with high spatial and time coherence, while it also required power incomparable with capacitors of regular sources of light. Let's look at the holography test arrangement. The object under test is illuminated by the laser's light beam, which is previously widened by a simple optical device. A light wave dissipated by the object, as well as the initial, that is reference wave, go on the photographic plate, which registers the occurring interference pattern. The plate is developed and recorded in a regular way, but it contains all information on the type of the tested object. This very plate is called a hologram. Outwardly, it is not any different from a regular light struck plate. Only when looking at it under a microscope, it is possible to notice, in some simplest cases, an arranged microstructure, which occurs as a result of the interference of two light waves. One can often see with the naked eye that a hologram has rings or stripes, but they appear as the result of diffraction of light on dust and do not have anything in common with the object's data. Light diffraction is the basis of holography. In a general case, holography is a complex structure of spots. Distance between them is about that of wavelength. Thus, in order to produce holograms, we need special high-quality photomaterials. Besides amplitude holograms, there are phase holograms, which are based on transforming not the amplitude of wavefronts, but phases themselves.